was made by Ben on the 3rd of the 6th, 19th, and you can use it by the 3rd of the 8th, 20. But you can also use it after as well, which if the scent's still there, if you can still smell it, it will be still able to use. And the secret message, which goes on the little thing, which is there are spirits in everywhere. Everywhere? Everything, sorry. And it has Orchimus infusion, cypress leaf infusion, fresh lime juice, cypress oil, lime oil, rosewood oil, Orchimus absolute meringue oil. And it is suitable for vegans and self preservatives. It says step beneath a warm waterfall and lather up beneath the lush green canopy, canopy of the forest. That's what it says how to use. And what's inside? Moringa oil from the Palmaculture Institute in Ghana helps to soothe and soften the skin as woody cypress leaf infusion. Please your mind and cr tranquility of the trees setting around you. Follow the footsteps of a mysterious creature to the glade of calming rosewood and earthy orchmas at the heart of the forest. I'll let you know what that smells like. It is green. Oh. That's kind of earthy, very earthy. So if you like, like your earth scents, that is perfect. It literally smells just like the bath bomb, very earthy and everything. And and it is a bit thick. But it's quite nice. That is Guardians of the Forest. The next one is, once I get through all this, I've got some samples as well. So I shall be reviewing them. Intergalactic, that obviously Jack made. That was kind of a spoiler. Which I thought, oh, are oh, they going to release every single shower gel or just one? But I'm happy they released six exclusives. Also the Cookie Door Body Scrub, which they released the Lip Scrub. But they released the body scrub as well, so you can pick that up as well. And it says, Invite the cosmos into your bathroom with this sparkly interstellar shower gel. I also mix of refreshing peppermint, grapefruit to rocket your mood sky high. And it says, How to use lather up over the skin in the shower and prepare to blast off into the funky. What's inside? Peppermint helps to stimulate blood flow, leaving your skin feeling tingly fresh and your good mind active. Good to know. Harvest from the roots of the plant, Fetifert is considered to be both grounding and soothing. It's been referred to as the oil of tranquility. And it has in peppermint oil, grapefruit oil, Fetifert oil, cedarwood oil. So it's very peppermint and also woody and fruity. And that's what it looks like. It's very sparkly. I'll let you know what it smells like. Oh, that is really, really refreshing and really, really nice. And it's sparkly as well. And I'll show see what the consistency is, like out, out of the bottle. So that's still a thick gel as well. That is intergalactic. The next one I'm going to review is, if I can find it, I've just seen the samples, I'll get to them in a bit. Sex Bomb. Now everybody knows Sex Bomb, it's a nice floral scent, smells really really nice and very floral as well. So if you like your floral, like your floral rose flowers, that's a really good one. And it says, it's time to unleash your inner bombshell. Seductive jasmine, clary sage and lang lang and chew it, the mood, a tree of enticing Fixins that make you feel truly ready to take anything in your stride. And it says, squirt liberally into the thorn palm of a hand. Then stroke over the body under a steamy hot shower. Why not invite a friend in to lend a helping hand? Sharing showers help save water too. Jasmine is an ancient aphrodisiac used as a sensual perfume in India for centuries and in armor. Aromatherapy to ease stress and anxiety. 
picked at sunrise when they're at their most fragrant. We source ours from India and Egypt. Good to know, Clary Sage is using aromatherapy to calm the nerves and encourage feelings of well-being, stimulating centrus in the fuckwit. It is the perfect ingredient to awaken your inner siren. And this is Baby, You Can Turn Me On as a Secret Message. It's got Jasmine Rose, Ginseng Infusion, Rose Center for that, Panax Ginseng, and then it's got Jasmine Absolute, Clary Sage Oil, Yalang Alang Oil, Fresh Passion Fruit Juice, so it's very fruity. And that's what it looks like, and I shall tell you what it smells like. Now, that is quite nice. It smells very floral, very rosy. You can definitely smell the jasmine and the lang lang. So that is sex bomb, and I'll let you know what the consistency is like. That's obviously a bit wet. So that is sex bomb. It's not thick as the other ones, but it is quite wet. Then we've got Groovy Kind of Love, which was one of the new bath bombs they released, but they made it as a shower gel. Obviously, because it's a brand new kind of one of the 50 bath bombs I think it's got released, or it might be more, I can't remember. I'll, I'll look in a bit and tell you what how many there is, guys, and the new bath bombs they've released. So it says, Lost Your Mojo, bring it back with the fresh and twist of bergamot and freshly squeezed orange juice, as well with soothing a lang lang and a fresh rose petal infusion. That will leave you feeling groovy baby. So it's kind of like Austin Powers. Austin Powers kind of thing. But it's obviously full of like orange, rose petal, all that kind of thing. So it's a very fruity shower gel. So it will make you feel very fruity and very sophisticated. And you feel good about yourself. How to use, oh come on, we don't. Need to tell you how to use a shower gel, do we? If you really don't know how, then we suggest you find someone you really like and fight them into the shower. You demonstrate. Now, Lush is very, very cheeky with adult inner windows that they will put that in just to put like a little bit of a jaw kind of thing. It's quite hilarious, but they're very cheeky about that. And it says, spread the loaf with sustainable sauce, rosewood oil obtained from Coppiced branches, meaning no trees were filled, felled in the harvesting process. Sorry about that. A light and bouncy blend of refreshing orange juice and bergamot oil will help lift the spirits while Ilang Lang and Rose dance, dance around you. And it says in the secret message, this sort of thing really is my bag, baby. And they'll tell you what it smells like. It was very orange. That, oh, that's very orangey and very fruity you can actually smell the orange juice and i shall tell you the consistency i'm not going to obviously squeeze it all out that is very very thick but watery as well so that's groovy kind of love that is two four shower gels that is two more to review goddess now if anybody doesn't if anybody loves goddess this is the best one it's a, it's kind of like masculine, feminine slash unisex. It smells so unreal. Like you can smell like it was made for Ariana Ariana Grande, which was goddess as a woman. So obviously a song she let them make a bath bomb for her. Obviously it was a circle. I'll show you the picture two seconds. I'll get it on me four. I get it two seconds. Like that's the if it'll oh, if I can get it. Oh two seconds. That is the bath bomb. It's a very sparkly bath bomb. And it's obviously got your jasmine in, so it's a very floral scent, but a lovely scent that ood comes out of it. So it says, 
Ingomatic Oud combines with sensual jasmine and sandalwood to surround your celestial body in an aura of divinity. And it says, how to use. Step into a shower of serenity, massage, massage over the skin, rinse off and enjoy the lingering and evocative scent of oud, jasmine and sandalwood. So it's very like woody, nice scent, all that. White tea infusion added to rose water. Soothes. Soothes and cleanses as the fruity and floral aroma of Omanthus fills the air. Good to know, dark and woody oud is one of the most expensive oils in the world, costing more in weight than gold, which I did not know, but now they've said, which is thank you, Lush, for saying that. Namaste in the shower, which is the secret message. And it has white tea infusion. It has rose water. Laurel bentine, titanium dioxide, jasmine oil, jasmine absolute, mamphif absolute. Rose oil, sandalwood oil, oud oil, carrageenan extract. So it's got like carrageenan from a uh, seaweed. So they use that in the shower jellies. And I shall let you know what it smells like. This is the first impression. So I have Love Me Goddess. That is dead on bath bomb, soap, everything goddess. It is amazing. It is really amazing. And I'll let you know how thick it is. But that is that is really nice. That is five up to now. And this should be the last one, which is turmeric latte. I've never smelled turmeric latte as bath bomb because obviously that's just come out as well. And obviously groovy kind of love I've never smelled before. But obviously I've just told you what that smells like. And it says, take a break from the daily grind and snuggle up to the warm golden octre of the shower gel. Sweet with a cosy blend of warming vanilla, tonga and benzine for stirring feelings of comfort and familiarity at any time of the day. So this is a sweet shower gel that's got your vanilla in. It's obviously warm as well and it'll be nice, nice to use. If it smells like black air, I will love it. If it doesn't, I'll also love it already because it's wash. So it says, create a frothy lather into a hot steamy shower. And allow the warm, addictive fragrance to percolate while you take a moment to yourself. Don't rush. You're going to want to savour every moment. Traditionally used for its antioxide properties. Properties. Um, we harness the natural power of turmeric in the shower gel to revive skin and give it a healthy glow. Good to know. Benzine, aristocrat. Resin harvest from the Sturex tree gives a warm and cosy note. So this fragrance is also effective at stimulating blood flow and locking moisture in the skin for longer. And the secret message is, and I'll tell you how what's actually in it. So the secret message is a whole a whole latte love. There's coconut and turmeric infusion. It has organic argyl syrup, tonka absolute. Benzine resin, resinide, vanilla absolute, cocoa powder, carrageenan extract. And I'll let you know what that smells like. Oh my god. That, that's like Christmas. That is like Christmas. That is so, it smells like cinnamon. Like it's crisp, like what you do when you put cinnamon on rice pudding. All that kind of stuff. It is amazing. And I'll show you the thickness. That is really nice. And I'll tell you what, what I rate all these for. That is 